For more videos on people's struggles, please subscribe to our YouTube channel. October 26th marked 100 days since the forced disappearance of five members of the Garifuna community in Honduras. The five were kidnapped by armed men dressed in police and military uniforms on July 18th in Triunfo de la Cruz, a small town on the Caribbean coast of Honduras. A demonstration was held in Triunfo de la Cruz on Monday to demand the safe return of the abducted members of their community. Since July, Honduran and international social movements and organizations, such as the Council of Popular and Indigenous Organizations of Honduras, COPIN, and the Guatemala Chapter of IJOS, Sons and Daughters for Identity and Justice Against Forgetting and Silence, as well as others, have been active in condemning the disappearances and in demanding this immediate, safe return. They have also demanded that the national government of Honduras investigate the case and bring the perpetrators to justice. Four of the five men abducted from their homes are part of the Fraternal Black Organization of Honduras, Ofrane, and had been working in defense of their ancestral land. Ofrane is a grassroots organization of the Afro-descendant and indigenous Garifuna community in Honduras that fights to defend their collective social, economic, cultural, and territorial rights. Since the disappearance of its members, Ofrane has denounced the government's lack of will to find the young men and provide clarity on the issue. The government's indifference has also increased the suspicion of the community about the involvement of the Honduran state in the crime. In a statement published on the three months anniversary of the disappearance, Ofrane denounced the right-wing government of President Juan Orlando Hernandez for inconsistencies in the report on the case presented to the Inter-American Human Rights Court. The organization denounced and condemned the criminal and complicit silence of the state of Honduras and called for international support to pressurize the government to stop the genocide of the Garifuna people who defend their ancestral territory from businessmen in the tourism sector and from neo-colonial projects.